Since taking the top job at Seed in November 2015, Luca DeMio has seen the Volkswagen Group BRAND and APOS sales grow, thanks to the popularity of the Attica and Arona SUVs in the latest generation Ibiza. But now DeMio has taken one of his boldest moves yet, turning SCAT and APOS S Cupra performance badge into a full standalone mark starting with the 296 bhp cupra attica the new brand will launch seven cupra models in the next three years speaking at the launch event for cupra demio explained the reasons for the move and his plans for the brand why launch cupra as a standalone brand the first reason is that we've seen from experience and data that cupra models do very well in some markets in Germany, for example, Cupra models make up 10 to 15 percent of the seat market share, so we can push for differing sensibilities for such products. Also, seat has put a focus on growing and gaining credibility. But in some markets there is still some rejection of the seat brand from people who are LET and APOS, SA, image sensitive. This we can fix, but we need time. Cupra is starting from scratch with something new. We start from a green field, and maybe with, that we can attract customers that in other cases might not buy a seat. Selling those kind of cars for us is much more profitable. This allows us to increase the conquest of the brand. 296 BHP Cupra Attica revealed as first car from seat performance brand. Will there be standalone Cupra models? Our decision is to work on variants of seat models, but I don't want to unveil too much of our future product plan. Because we are not in a hurry to tell you the full story, and it will take years to get to the level we want. The mainstream of our thinking is to use the base we have with seat models and develop them. And make every generation each time more extreme, sophisticated and different. When we are able to have that kind of platform there may be some projects that would be unfeasible on the seat brand that might find a justification from a financial point of view, because we have achieved a certain price point. Our ambition is to do something that authentically expresses our vision of what Cupra should be. We have a few things in the drawer, but for the time being our decision is to work on variants. Dot opinion, why Cupra split from seat? Will Cupra be separate from SEAT? My assumption is that this thing will stay in the world of SEAT. It's kind of an elite team that works on expressing the best of what we can. But the whole thing will be part of our organization. If this team is able to get to the next level, that will have an influence on all of SEAT. It's a cultural effect. Dot Cupra could get electric powertrain tech before SEAT. What is the positioning of Cupra in the market? We see the pricing for Cupra models falling between volume and premium. We still want to be a value for money proposition. There is no car like the Attica Cupra in the market at the moment. How does this move change what Cupra is? Today, Cupra is a badge for car enthusiasts, NWE and APOS. V sold over 60,000 units in 40 countries in the past 20 years. But the decision to launch Cupra as a standalone brand is not just a business decision or an engineering move, this is a declaration of love for motoring. In a society that has become unfriendly to the sector, 